Welcome, this is the Energy Vibration Reading for Old Sun, Moon and Rising um, Signs. And I want to say to each and every person, thank you for being here. Thank you for being back. This has been a wonderful Energy Vibration Reading. I want to say to each and every person that is here, this is um, the third week of the, May, of the month of May and the week begins from the 15th until the 21st it is the 20th week of the year 2017 okay the energy vibration in this in this week is is, 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 is is weird but it's all about transformation for you guys um, the zodiac energy and um, you begin the week with the zodiac energy from the art the earth energy and you end the week uh, with uh, the energy from the hair and in the weekend there's good news that is going to come from um, your your child if your child is uh, of an water energy there's good news that is going to come from him in the weekend good news very good news um, so what, uh, whatever situation is going on um, this week is uh, the energy vibration of the Empress okay energy vibration of the Empress and with the energy vibration of the Empress uh, what we're seeing here and what is happening here is that a lot of changes are happening a lot of changes are happening for you guys you have the energy vibration of debt that debt is the energy vibration of debt and transformation to a situation that you had dealt with with past work um, situations okay so for some people it's going to be a situation that you had uh, is debt and transformation to your work situation where um, some people is going to start a new job and some people um, is looking at uh, um, it's not boredom and the five of cup is not really that is is that how it has happened it's as if your boss or an organization that you used to work with have done something that was very bad and they have tried to make to 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 look good in the situation it's not going to happen because the truth came out so um, this is the scenario for you Capricorns uh, that is going to happen in the third in, in this third week so for some people it's going to be that you overcome a situation that you had to deal with with um, your uh, organization that you have worked with um, for some of you and for some of you it's going to be that you finally end a situation that was happening with an organization that um, really was happening okay so it's gonna be a little bit of a um, of, of a, um, a, a long reading I would not really long but there's a lot of messages coming out here and as I was talking I was asked to pull more cards to because your reading is so strong it's all about a situation that the organization did you have worked with a company and somebody either in the company or the, the entire company well the organization which sometimes always HR or somebody who is HR or somebody who did something and this is finally coming to an end so there's a transform trans a transformation and with this transformation the Empress bring this transformation for you Capricorns this is a strong week because the Empress you Capricorns are governed or the Empress so whenever these things because it was a week when I was looking I was asking my guides and angels there's a lot going on here um, I need to to know what is you know what is the coupling part to this and what is coupling part to that so yeah okay I'm gonna go further I'm gonna um, give you what is going to happen daily on Monday you have the father of Pentacles which is for you men you're starting out the week on a strong note for the women it's going to be extremely good it's going to be a balanced week on Monday money is going to come to you the energy vibration of money is going to come to you this is the starting off of the week so it could be that you're starting a new job and it could be that your old job is paying you some money money is coming towards you okay as we look at Tuesday which you have two energies and this is so strange and I was wondering if I did not um, um, if I didn't um, 
shuffle the card set you had first the four of cups and then you have the five of cups and the four of cups is a situation where you're bored the five of cups is a situation where you regret something and what you did is regret a situation that your ex a company that you have worked with somebody who you have worked with before or someone people had done something against you and you regret that my now there is a transformation that is happening in this situation so on Tuesday you have a situation to do with your boss you are happy that you walked away you make the decision what you did you are so happy about this and it is not about just that one boss it's about certain things that happen you found out that certain people and certain things okay on Wednesday in the middle of the week you have a situation with an organization you have the energy vibration of the daughter of Pentacles the daughter of Pentacles is a wonderful energy the daughter of Pentacles bring wonderful beautiful financial stability in your life and you are going to meet someone who is of a Pentacles and an earth energy in an organization okay so some people will be starting work in a new organization or connecting in a new organization you're going to meet someone who is younger than you are who is the same energy vibration of the hurt energy and you're going to connect with them it's going to be a young Taurus person and this is going to be a good relationship but remember don't give too much of yourself as we move on on Thursday we have a situation on Thursday if you are having a relationship if your partner if uh, your partner up in um, love affair with um, um, the king of swords be aware he's gonna come at you and you're gonna walk away from him okay so it's like that there was a still and then it started up back and this king of sword is going to come at you from an angler you're going to walk away from him you're going to think I am NOT going to deal with this or it's it's, it's it's gonna bring you you know so it says do I stay do I go do I walk away from this okay so it's actually good because it is bringing you um, opportunities okay whatever had happened with you and this um, father of swords it's going to bring you opportunities it can be um, a connection of a partner or it can be um, a connection of uh, um, a friend's cup or business okay but what I'm seeing here is that it is the energy vibration of wonderful new energies that wants to come in but it's not um, aware or open up to come in so here is where you have uh, um, a situation that is going so it can be good for some people because here you have the seven of cups the seven of cups is always opportunities coming out the seven of cups is opportunities coming out so be aware of whatever is happening on Thursday with a loved one on Friday this is good on Friday we have the energy of the star the energy of the star on Friday and the energy of the wheel of fortune oh my god <laughs> okay okay people you have the energy of the star and the wheel of fortune on Friday oh my god congratulations you Capricorn whoa okay I am so grateful for you guys this is just going to be soup super 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 congratulations I have to take my glasses off for that okay where should we go with this on Friday you have the energy of the star the star is always your wishes and dreams are coming true the universal angels are stepping in whatever you want it's coming to you and the wheel of fortune is that if you have been going through a rough time and whatever the wheel of fortune is coming to take you out of this on Friday and you are going to be triumphant and victorious okay what would you like to have the ace of Pentacles or the energy of Pentacles or the star and the wheel of fortune 
Oh my gosh, congratulations. I looked at your reading in the beginning when I bring out the energy vibrations of it and I was thinking to myself and I, I thought oh my god what, what a strange reading because the other energy vibrations of the earth sign they had just wonderful readings it's strange and then I realized that you know and I was asking as I said to you I was asking so on Friday you're no longer in the Angman situation things are working out I am loving this for you guys. Okay. As we look at the weekend, the weekend is fantastic because on Saturday you will have the Six of Wands, which is wonderful. And the Six of Wands is good news. And this good news is good news over a situation that has was unjust to you, a situation that was really unjust to you. And if you have kids and the kids... Um, whatever separation that you had with your kids and that sort of a thing and something happened um, to you when you were a child that was injustice or to your child and yourself in the weekend it's going to be balanced because we have the six of wands and the son of cups so again if you have a water sign child and something has happened an injustice has happened to you the universe is going to bring you good news and this good news is going to be also good news from your son okay so for some people on Saturday um, justice good news is going to happen um, and for some people if you have a child that is from a water sign energy he is going to bring you good news so this is just going to be extremely wonderful this is going to be extremely positive I wasn't seeing your reading as I'm seeing it now but for you guys now I know why the transformation comes out because whenever transformation comes out is that whatsoever that was happening to you that was injustice or not injustice or you know um, it, it's going to end it's the end it's ending and the Empress who govern you as a Capricorn is ending and bringing new situations so whatever injustice that has happened door work people who who you worked for and they have done you what sort of an injustice this situation is going to come to an end justice is going to come in um you the energy of you connecting um of, of what they did you're going to feel sorry about but what is going to happen is that you're going to move away from that you're going to move on you're going to see it as um, a lesson in your life because sometimes these things happen but it has nothing to do with you it has to do with them and if you see if the situation um, get explode that mean a whole lot of people had to clear their karma so most of the time it is nothing that has to do with you you are the focus main main, main point but you are going to see that what's to ever had happened is going to heal and there's going to be what energy vibration is going to cleanse the situation okay so you're going to see the organization the people and whatever you're going to put them behind you and you're going to look forward and by doing that you're going to connect with someone of the earth energy vibration in us in a in an organization that is going to help you and connect you okay and um, the, the energy vibration with the lovers um, some of you are going to meet or have as your partner the the father of the sword and um, that this person is going to help you um, um, to open up opportunities for you in your life which is extremely good I found that to be extremely good and last but not least Friday you carry the energy vibration because Friday has the general energy of the chariot okay that is the general energy of the chariot on Friday then you had the energy of the, the star and then you have the energy of the wheel of fortune okay people I am not sure 
but I think you guys are going to start seeing wonderful things coming in your life as of the month of June okay because normally when this um, transformation the debt transformation and all the negative aspects are cleaning up two weeks later three weeks later is always between two and three weeks later you always start seeing this so the, your wishes and dreams are going to come through and the wheel of fortune is going to come up and this is just going to be one of the most beautiful beautiful time and beautiful energy in your life so open up accept this as I've always said I would prefer to have victory and success the chariot the star and the wheel of fortune in in place of uh, um, um, because what happened is that the money the uh, these all bring you money love luck and everything and it's better to have luck and wonderful energies that's coming in your life again I need to stress on the weekend whatsoever is going to happen in the weekend your son um, if your son is of a water energy vibration he's going to connect with you and he's going to bring you good news um, again that he's connecting he's letting you know that he's going to connect with somebody because the daughter of Pentacles is here the king of Pentacles is also here so um, if you have a child with another earth energy vibration person and it is the energy vibration of a water sign child you are going to connect with the father of this so the weekend is going to be a balance of family but it's going to be a balance of new wonderful things that are coming in your life and it's going to be a, a weekend where you and your child and your child father is going to have a sort of a connection and this connection is going to be good because there's going to be a lot of healing coming in and with this healing that is coming in you're going to see wonderful things coming through remember again the person we are going to connect with the father of swords this father of swords is going to bring you success okay because he's right between the energy vibration of the dot of Pentacles and success coming in so um, the father of Pentacles could be an energy vibration that you're connecting with someone who is having a child who is the daughter of Pentacles okay and this is just going to work out positive for you positive a lot of positive energy vibrations are going to come out for you Capricorns in this week and as I am working with the energy vibration of the conscious spirit we're going to see um, what for energy vibration is here the conscious spirit the conscious spirit what is here for the Capricorns this is here for the Capricorns we have the energy vibration of spirit awakeness I embrace my soul purpose and align all aspects of my life to the fullest I awaken I embrace I embrace my soul purpose and align all aspects of my life to its fullest. I align all aspects of my life to its fullest. This, this is a wonderful energy vibration and I'm saying namaste until next week.